Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Asa. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Bruce. The Dragon Lee! Herb Dean, ready. a referee for this ready. one. Good. All right, here's Bruce Lee getting ready for another UFC start as we begin round one. So fast, so quick, so good at setting up striking angles, and it's hard to simulate the speed in training. I know the opponent has talked a lot about trying to find training partners to simulate Bruce Lee. Easier said than done. Bruce Lee trying to get off to a good start tonight. Landed a nice left hook there, I, I feel. Get those combinations going. Those oh, nice jab by Lee. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Checks the leg kick. Wow, strong roundhouse kick there. Frantic pace early on to this one. Nice side kick. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Oh, you land, I land is how we're doing here. Just out of range with that strike. Lee gets absolutely tagged by that stiff jab. Oh, nice job to block the kick. Right on the button. Just over three minutes here to go round one. Going to the body now with that hook shot. Nicely done by Lee. This work. Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that pitch. Nice counter left there. Just misses with a left hook there. Nice leg kick. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Just over two minutes to go in the round. So there it is, taller fighter landing a knee to the body. Back to the well with the uppercut, now it's true. Oh, he lands another shot to the head. Oh, and he lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Lead kick landed there by Lee. Oh, how good was that combo? He is really doing a nice job stringing his shots together now. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Nice body kick. Ooh, big shot lands. That well, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. 
back kick there. Hands high, hands high. Nice combination. Trying to kick the leg out. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. All right, so some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. A lot of strikes to the body starting to start to add up. Yeah, a lot of strikes to the body and mixing up the attack, not being one-dimensional, not headhunting inside the octagon. I, I think he has fought beautifully right now, and it's starting to show itself. 15 seconds. Lead left by Lee. Nice head kick gets through. Right. Round two straight ahead. All right, buddy, take a seat. Deep breath, buddy. Breathe. All right, let's get him some water. Take a drink. All right, here we go. Listen, you're doing absolutely awesome. Ready to fight? Ready. All right, second round underway. All right, next round is underway. And how about the head movement and the slips? Really a beautiful defensive effort to watch in that previous round. It looked as if he was training in his boxing ring with the two ropes spread across. Oh, he's got to try to finish here. Beautiful spinning kick lands. Great defense on this play there. Well, the more things change, the more they stay the same. He continues to land a high volume of strikes. On his I mean, John, the guy can fight everywhere. And he can fight everywhere, meaning he can fight on the ground. He can fight in the stand-up. But he's also able to do it because his cardio is so good. Right. This is one of the best fighters that we have seen for a long time. And it is showing in this performance. Cut them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Nice punch to the head. Oh, another strike to the torso right there. Got to get better defensively, or that's going to be a real factor as this fight continues. He's got to cut that elbow. Yeah. I mean, he's got that elbow flaring, and every time his opponent's going right up under it and landing, right to the body. He's got to do something different right now or he's going to get to a point where he will not be able to continue this fight. Well, as my favorite rap group Onyx would say, stick and move, right? Beautiful slip off the center line there. Yeah, what a great job of moving his head. It doesn't take much to avoid a punch. Well, at times he's tried to check kicks, but he has not been effective in doing so. And now he's starting to limp a little bit. He's starting to limp from those leg kicks. He's showing work, that it's hurting. That's a, that's a big sign. Oh, what a connection by him there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Oh, nice. Two minutes to go in round two. Oh, big diamond punch to the head. Lee's trying for a submission here. Oh, his 
He opened up now. Nasty cut on the bridge of the nose. Outstanding work with the ground and pound here by Lee. Making all these shots count. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Caught the kick. That landed. Oh, roundhouse kick. Add that to his highlight reel. Under a minute now to go. All right, so now we start to see some bruising appearing on the torso and all of that courtesy of the body work of his opponent. Just the, the wherewithal to go to the body and the discipline to stay with that approach. I mean, it's just tremendous. You, you see a fighter with a high fight IQ following a game plan, and it's working. Well, no feeling out process tonight. Both fighters invoking damage on the other DC. Yeah, it's, we knew this would be very competitive. We knew that this was a tough fight. We knew that both guys would be very evenly matched in this fight. But we didn't expect to see this type of war between these two guys. So the round is over and you see some obvious bleeding now. Looks like the cut is on the nose. Yes, it is. Cut man will try to get in there and shut it. But of course, as soon as he absorbs a strike this next round, that thing could reopen. Certainly bears watching here moving forward. All right, so a high level round there for him. We'll show you some of the action here. And you got to think the knockdown is going to be featured prominently here. Thought he might have had him out of there. He thought he had him. But the guy's tough. The guy's durable. He has a fantastic chin. But he just needs to stay the course. He does not need to be discouraged. Think about this. You're winning, and you're winning going away. That was just a moment. Keep going in the same direction, and you will get the finish that you want so bad. You ready to fight? Ready. Third Good. round underway. Oh, that is a nasty inside leg kick, DC. It is a great technique but it only takes one time to check it, right. and your night can be over. Or you can end up like Anderson Silva. Be careful. Got an issue? Here's a tip. A swing and a miss by Lee. And that's spinning kicked out. It's home up top. Oh, that's a beautiful land downstairs with the kick. Beautiful strike there as he continues to attack that cut. Cut man's gonna have some work to do if we get to the stool between rounds. But that's why we got the best in the business. We got the best cut men in the business, and they are going to need him right now because this cut is getting worse, and it's only gonna continue to get worse because he has got a killer in front of him. Well, one got through, that kick was blocked. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. The left punch is true, now the right hand. Looks like someone took a red sharpie to his side. A lot of bruising courtesy of those body strikes. Well, big kicks, big punches. He's doing everything he told us he intended to do. Oh, a huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up with him. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Lands a beautiful leg kick. Well, he rocked him, but couldn't finish him. He rocked him. He hurt him bad. He couldn't find that one shot to close the door. He could not shut the lights off. And now, he's tasked with trying to find that shot again. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. He really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. And we have passed the midpoint of the fight. Oh, 
Oh, man, it ain't Dikembe Mutombo, but he is blocking all these shots coming man, his way. get that out of here. He sees it coming. You're going to have to mix it up. Shake that finger. Shake that finger. leg kick and just slap yourself hard on the inside of your leg and tell me how that feels. I mean, it really hurts because that's the soft right. part of your leg. So you land that over and over again, guy will have a very tough time maneuvering out of a lot of the techniques you go at. Well, you can sense the corner frustration. He has not had any answer for these body shots, and now you see the visible damage. Well, his coaches are wondering, where's the defense? We worked on this. We knew this would be an attack that they would come with. Why are you not doing what we train? He's got to change something, man. He's got to tuck that elbow. He's got to roll and turn. He cannot continue to take these body shots. Nice strike from the bottom fighter there. His nose is all crooked. It's all beat up. It's bleeding. He got hurt bad. That nose looks broken. Good work from the top here by Lee. Well, you got to think he's going to enjoy watching this one back tomorrow morning. He has landed a ton of significant strikes. And Really, a guy who has been a monster in the gym finally putting it together here in the Rocky. You could go home and admire your work, it doesn't take you the next morning. You can go back to him right now and fire up the video to look at beauty in action. And he was the one causing all the action. Get the out here. Lee's in half court. Inside the closed guard now. I mean, he went right into his full guard. What does he do to try to advance himself to give him more of an advantage on the map? All right, 20 seconds to go. Oh, picture perfect shot there, DC. And one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. So far. All right, so the fighter heads back to the stool, and man, that is a severe cut that he's dealing with. We'll see if they call in the ringside physician. All right, well, I'm no doctor. I'm not going to diagnose a broken nose, but a huge cut on the bridge, and his opponent continues to attack it. Continues to attack it as he should. He did the damage. He was the one that landed the shot that opened up that cut. Now he's got to make his opponent pay for it. He was a bit lax in the defense, and now he's got that massive cut on the bridge of his nose. You ready to fight? Ready. Fourth round now, fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Oh, he is stunned trying to recover here. The hook lands on the counter. He's just being more aggressive, and because he's being more aggressive and more loose with his strikes, he's landing. Oh, nice jab, nice kick. Oh, man, that cut is getting worse by the minute. Looking ghastly at this point. Nice front kick there. Big shot there to both of them. Side kick lands for him there, champ. A lot of times that is used to manage space. Oh, really making good use of his reach advantage as he lands the straight punch there. Defense. Trying the flying knee there. Well, an incredible fight thus far. Both fighters look like they could be finished at any time. If you wondered about the heart on either side, that question was answered tonight. Nothing. There are no more questions in regards to these two fighters. Both of these men have been hurt. Both of these men are swollen. They're bloody. They're both, even though them, they're both willing and ready to continue this fight. 
Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. Beautiful. Oh, that is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Nice display of technique by him there on the sidekick. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Very traditional technique that a lot of guys are using now in the UFC. Just out of range with that left hook. Mixing it up well tonight. There's a shot to the leg. Effective with the jab. Would you look at the size of that bruise on his torso? Nasty. Oh, up the Oh, he's hurt. He's wobbling. Attack, attack, attack. Under two minutes to go in the round. And once again, looking for that highlight reel KO with that front kick. Landed by the opposition. Oh, he's looking to set up that head kick. No good. advantage there with that land, DC. 30 seconds to go here. Back and forth we go. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes up. So the blood continues to be a major factor in this fight. And I think at some point the referee is going to intervene here, DC. He hasn't been able to change anything, right? So it doesn't, we have no indication that he's going to be able to stay in this fight. The cut was open very early, and now we're at a point where it's going to be stopped due to all the blood and how limited he is in trying to stay in this fight. All right, back to the stools we go, and that is a really severe cut, so we will monitor him between rounds as they furiously get the cut man in there. Ready to fight? Ready. Good. It is the fifth and final round. Back to the hook now. Well, new round, same narrative. He continues to punish the body yet again, just as he did in the previous frame. He does a great job of getting that leg kick to the target. Oh, there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Sets up that leg kick beautifully. The issue with that kick has effects. Oh, oh my God! Oh, these guys are absolutely getting after it. Huge shots landing on both sides. Unable to connect with the right. 
And he's able to work his way back to his feet. All right, so the referee, yes, is going to step in here. He will call on the doctor to look at that nose that is unrecognizable at this stage of the fight. His nose is broken. Yeah. I mean, it's turned sideways. The blood's pouring, going down into his mouth. It looks like he's having a very difficult time breathing. Looks like he's almost willing himself to stay in this fight, and doctor's going to give him a chance. Somewhat surprising there. That cut is nasty. It's a nasty cut. All right, so the ref will get the action back underway after that brief health and safety check. And to no one's surprise, the fans support the decision for the action to continue. Absolutely. I mean, this official decided you can go. He's had a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he lands. Great job. Oh! Oh, look at that. Straight right hand, no good. Oh, and he caught the kick. Well, this is getting hard to watch, and sometimes you hear us say a fighter is too tough for their own good. Anybody want to save this athlete right now? Yeah, this is, this is a classic case of that, where a guy is just too tough. He's not going to win this fight. He may as well throw in the towel. I mean, his corner can stop it, the referee can stop it, the doctor can stop it. Somebody needs to do something because this fight is over. If you're going to go out, go out on your shield. If you're going out, go out on your shield. Don't just walk backwards. Go forward. Make him fight you. Good work, guys. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. most of them upstairs, and when those big shots land repeatedly, the referee has no choice but to step in and call the fight. Bruce Buffer now with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 46 seconds of round number 5. Declaring the winner by TKO, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Well, what else can you say about Bruce Lee after a performance like this one? Seemingly everyone on the roster wants to take their cracks against one of the founding fathers of mixed martial arts. And candidly, thus far, few men have succeeded. This just might have been...